Hey guys, this is Scott Dex, Grasshopper with DelmarGrasshoppers.com. Uh, have you ever had trouble with yellow or wilting leaves on your plants? Well, I'm going to show you a couple tips today that, uh, that may help you perk those leaves up. Alright, if you're experiencing yellowing or wilting of your leaves, uh, there's a variety of reasons that that could happen. Uh, it could be that bacterial, it could be a lack of nutrients, it could be overwatering, it could be underwatering, it could be heat, it could be a sudden cold. Uh, so there's a lot of reasons. All right, the tips I'm going to give you right now are um, how to amend your soil uh, by adding some calcium uh, with either eggshells or calcium carbonate with uh, Tums. And if you're a hardcore organic uh, grower, uh, you may want to just go with the eggshells. There are some things in there that, that uh, some people may consider non-organic. Um, Epsom salt, which is uh, magnesium sulfate. And uh, the other tip I was going to give you was if you are watering with city water, uh, most municipal um, water systems go ahead and put chlorine in the water and that is another thing that can, uh, can lead to wilting and yellowing of your leaves. So a real easy tip for that is to uh, gather your bucket or whatever you use to water with and instead of pouring it right on your plants, you go ahead and leave it overnight uh, sitting outside and that will give the time for the, uh, for the chlorine to um, evaporate. Um, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you how I prepare the, uh, the, the, either the tums or the eggshells with the Epsom salt and uh, then we're going to put it on the plants and I'll show you that. All right, the proportions that you're going to want to use are, with the eggshells, uh, it really doesn't matter uh, how much you put in there. Um, I'm going to put one eggshell per plant. Um, for Tums, you want to do one Tum per plant. And then for your Epsom salt, you want to do tea one, just one teaspoon uh, of Epsom salt. Okay, so let's go ahead and do the eggshell first. Put it in there. And just... That's about the consistency that I like to have it. And then we're going to go ahead and pour it into our tablespoon and then pour a teaspoon of Epsom salt. And we're going to pour that in there with that. And I'm going to shake it up to mix it together. And there you go. And now we're going to pour it on the plant. All right, now what you want to do is dig out uh, a little trench two to three inches away from the plant. Try to distribute it uh, evenly around. Put your soil back in over it. Go ahead and water that in. And there you go. All right, guys and gals. Well, you can see how easy it is to uh, just add a few little things that might help your leaves to stay healthy and green. Um, so uh, give that a try if you have those yellowing or wilting leaves. Uh, make sure you don't overwater and make sure you provide enough water for them. And also, like I said, if you're going to water with city water, go ahead and leave it out overnight and let that chlorine evaporate off. So um, that's it for that quick tip. Uh, if you like it, give me a thumbs up. If, uh, if it helps you out, leave me a comment, okay? Um, so until the next time, this is Scott, the ex-grasshopper with NoMoreGrasshoppers.com, helping you to plan for tomorrow so you can live for today. We'll see you later.